Operation Mousetrap. Oh my god. Think I can get there this way? Oh. Oh! I have been yeeted. to be on here. Holy crap. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> Hi, Marshi Wu. How are you doing? All right, troops. Listen up. As you all know, Bentley is still unavailable. But we've got to come up with a plan. So I'm calling this meeting for him. Hey, Carmelita. Quiet, Ringtail. We don't have time for your smart remarks. We've got to hit Penelope before she can finish... Whatever it is she's trying to finish. Yeah, that's kind of what I was going to ask. Look, it's pretty simple. We need to get into that castle. We've got the explosives. I was going to bring that up, too. Not another word, Sly. Your <laughs> speech does nothing to lift our spirits, Sly. Gallop, do you think we could plant your explosives on the bridge controls? Sounds! This plan rings true! Okay, everyone get ready to move out. After that bridge comes down, we'll have to get in there fast. Sorry, I missed the part about what we do when we get inside. We'll have to improvise. Sounds good to me. Great meeting. All right, we got to get in there. How? Blow it up. And what else? You know, we'll figure it out. I'd like to call bullshit on that. Anytime I've ever been in the water, uh, I drowned. Carmelita has kind of wanted to, to get with all of Sly's ancestors for the most part. She likes Tennessee. She likes Gallus now. Hi, what up, gaming? How are you been? Forth and smash that mechanical monstrosity! <clears throat> Gallop, wait! Uh oh. Why, thank you, Gallop. I've been looking all over for that. <sighs> she is making her escape! I don't think so. What? Uh oh. That's an uh oh. Oops, I mean the... Woo! Over here. I can reach your shoulder with an arrow. Mm, I probably just shoot through there. Whatever. Uh oh! Uh oh! Uh -oh. I'm gonna get ya. How you storm arrow? Yes, score one for the good guy. Woo! Yay! Woo! You fool! Oh my God! She just moved all of the fucking. Got ya. I did it. I'm totally good at, oh my god. Hey, 
Hey, Penelope, I saw some rust spots over there. It don't matter. If I can take that core out, I can take her down. Huh? Great. Looks like I gotta take those arms out again. Well, excuse me, I gotta go. Re oh my god. Arrow slide. Let him fly. <laughs> Arrow slide. Let him fly. What? <laughs> Oh god, Shai's got another question. This should be good. What's wrong, Penelope? Feeling disarmed? Ow. I'll crush you like a buck. Get over, Cooper. Fun fact, I let him get hit by that on the first time on purpose, because that was such a terrible fucking pun that I decided you had to get smacked for it. Now I'm getting the hang of this. Well, stop messing up my neck. Now, Sly, go for the heart. Endure and you shall prevail, Sly. Gotcha. No. Ready, Cooper. It's time to pay the fiddler. That's enough, Penelope. Huh? You heard me. Bentley, your soup is that my my moat monster? Yeah, what's left of it anyway. The design was adequate. I made some adjustments. Hmm. It was just a prototype anyway. Why'd you do it, Penelope? You owe me that much, at least. Why? For you, of course. I had to make you see how things could be. I'm not going to be one of the bad guys, Penelope. Ha! Huh, bad guys? That's kind of funny, Bentley, seeing as how you work for a thief. But you know the most valuable thing Sly ever stole? Your potential. Together, we could change the world. But you're still chasing after honor for jump change. When are you gonna wake up? So you sold out to La Paradox for the money? No, you're not listening. He's just a means to an end. Wow. And I thought you were smart. Do you really think he's going to just let you go? He owns you now. You're his puppet. And when you've served your purpose, he's going to cut your strings. I'm nobody's puppet. Too bad I can't say the same for you. I'm sorry, Bentley, but I guess it's time to make this breakup official. Penelope, wait! We don't have to do it like this! Oh, I think we do. It's time to cut some strings for good. <coughs> mech fight, mech fight! Woo! the rest of your game now. I'm gonna turn you into tinfoil. Bap, bap, and then whoa. whoa. User error. <laughs> ow, ow, ow. Oh, I have a stamina gauge. I did not realize that. I cannot dodge. What's super? Oh my god! I guess that's super. I do not have stamina to run away. Come on! 
There we go. I cannot. You are a total system failure. Try asking all the really like paradox questions. You should have stayed in your shower. Is this from Spider-Man? The new Spider-Man, is that what, what's got you asking this question, Shy? Watch it. You can't run forever. God, using super was a terrible idea. I have no stamina to really dodge or do anything. <laughs> Ooh, looks like you've got a bad motivator. That hurt. Nope, stop. I can't I can't cancel my animation. Nope. Try again. Nothing but scrap metal. <laughs> it's technically from Persona 2. <laughs> Is that the best you've got? Your friends can help you now. Excuse me. Penelope absolutely betrayed the team. Yeah, you missed that little plot twist. No, no, no I can't. I only mean to do one punch, but it just like fucking goes into the combo whether I want it to or not. Whoa, your belts are showing. You should have stayed in your shell. Yeah. I think you need a recharge. <laughs> and bam. Got zero chance. Oh, oh, okay. I gotcha. Finish her. Are we gonna? I, uh, think it froze. Nope. Yep. <laughs> Fuck. <sighs> Should I save the game here? It won't take me right back here. It'll take me to this mission. Or, like, right after this mission. Alright, uh... I, it just... It just didn't do anything. It just... It just kind of froze. <laughs> huh, well, fuck, we're here again. Well, whatever. So you like you think you're you think you're anal analyzing this vector? <laughs> <properly>? <laughs> okay, that was 
should have stayed in your shell. That neck design is so 2005. <laughs> Looks like I just voided your warranty. Wow, your servo response is slow. Nope. Smells like Bye. Some oh, okay, I guess we're just gonna skip that. Uh. There we go. Thanks, Bentley. Look, I'm sorry about Penelope. No, Sly, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I wasn't there to help you guys the whole time. It's okay. She fooled us all, pal. I guess. But that's no excuse for me not being there. I lost sight of my true friends. That won't happen again. Uh, hey, guys! Uh, we could use some help over here! Sounds like they need some help getting out of there. Know anyone that could swing that? Well, I do know this one guy, but he's probably busy, so I guess I'll have to do it. <laughs> it's good to have you back, Bentley. We contacted Dimitri, who started in about sandstorms and camel spit. Well, we finally deciphered enough to realize it was my ancestor Salim al Kupar who was in trouble now. Which meant we needed to get to ancient Arabia on the double. This time, Carmelita provided the solution. Before the Paradox grabbed her back at the museum, she'd managed to pocket a gold coin as evidence. And our luck held, as it turned out the antique gold piece was exactly what we needed. As we prepared to leave, everyone was keeping an eye on Bentley. He downplayed his heroics and refused to acknowledge that he'd saved us all. I sensed a new confidence in him, which I guess had come from finally confronting his personal demons. He'd been through so much, but when it really mattered, he bounced back stronger than ever. I was sure about two things. I couldn't be more proud of Bentley, and we were going to need every ounce of his newfound strength to take down the paradox. You ever have a really bad breakup and then you just like leave your bitch stranded in the middle of time? <laughs> Hashtag relatable. When you say she's in the past, you literally mean it. We'd travel to ancient Arabia to find Salim al Kupar, an ancestor said to possess the stealth of 40 thieves. No surprise then when Bentley's research revealed that this guy was a charter member of the infamous 40 Thieves. For once, it appeared we'd have plenty of backup to help out with this job. When we arrived, however, we were shocked to find that most of the thieves had already retired. Having made their fortunes and gotten older, these great thieves had decided to call it quits and enjoy their golden years in peace. What wasn't shocking was the unmistakable presence of Cyril the Paradox. Nasty looking guards patrolled everywhere and it was clear that something sinister was going on. After some detective work, Bentley had even worse news. No one had seen Salim al Kupar for some time. He had been working with a few of the remaining thieves but had simply vanished. So where was he? That was the first thing we needed to figure out.
All right, let's go check out. Ooh, that's a nice shot right there. Nice shot of the sunset. Dang, these loading screens. All right, here we go. Ooh. 1,000 AD. Fuck it! Forget! Oh, I'm sorry, did I just drown in fucking... inch deep water? Excuse me? <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> what? You see that crab? Ow! Bitch. I'm supposed to corroborate my story! Oh, I'll knock you into that water. It's deadly. <sighs> oh my god, it's his ass. Get out of my face. Ooh, you got something to do it. Uh oh. I don't I don't remember how to oh, that's not it. I don't remember how I uh how I spoke okay, bum. Sly. Word on the street is that Salim Al Kupar was driven into hiding, but that he's still in the area. We need to figure out where he's hiding and then find out why. To facilitate that, I've built you a new toy. Cool. Is it a robotic turtle butler? No. After gathering data from your ancestors, I've been able to map the Cooper DNA. I've modified your binocucom with a new visual guidance system that I've programmed to detect anything with which Salim al Kupar may have come in contact. Wow, Bentley. That's some real science fiction. Bro, you're literally traveling through time and you're gonna call that science fiction? Thank you for the 35 bits when I'm gaming- Uh oh! Campbell, hi! Oh, camera? What was that? I gotta go! Ooh! Let me just jump on these swords. Hex excuse me. There we go. So how's everybody's night going? Wow. I wonder if Salim was trying to see if he could summon a genie for one of these lamps. He must be really desperate. Activate your binocucom and scan the surrounding areas. You should see a glow on any object that Salim has recently touched. Hmm. <coughs> Might need to go and grab some drinks myself, Michael. Alright. Whoa! Let me just be touching everything. 
I supposed to take a picture of it or? Hey! Fucking, I remember you. You snakes in a, in a basket. I was supposed to take a picture of it, okay. Why, that door definitely does not belong here. You better get a picture of that as well so I can analyze it. Okay, Sly, you should get out of there and head for the village while I sort this out. I've marked a waypoint for you. <laughs> exactly, Hardy. I'm so sick of these motherfucking snakes, these motherfucking baskets. Two games full of them. Not about it. Your PC can't run Doom Eternal? That's unfortunate. I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, maybe get it on your PlayStation? Whoops, didn't mean to change into that. There's a thing over here. I kind of want to go where that is. <clears throat> oh, over there, huh? Look at all these pillows. Whee! There's something close by. Use your binoculars. I am on top. I'm too close. <sighs> there we go. Nope. I have to. Oh my god. Are you serious? Eh, eh, eh. There we go. That should be perfect. Nailed it. This looks like a peaceful spot. I'll bet Celine uses this place for meditating. Oh, I'm so nervous. Ah, that, that's not a landing spot. What do you? S All right. <laughs> well, shit. Now what? Oh. Wee! There we go. You're aiming to get a new PC. Do you build your PCs uh, by yourself or do you buy pre-built? Where? Up fucking up there? Oh, there. Quick, fly the binocu cop. There's something nearby. I'm sorry, does you s I thought he spotted me up here and I was gonna say what the fuck? Oh, it's over there. Why am I on that? No, get on the Get on the rope. Welcome back. Welcome back, Michael. Yeet! Excuse me. I, I must be off. I'm sorry. Yoink. Well, I have to be standing over there, really? Bye. Ooh. 
here. Where? Fucking where? Ow. Alright. I can't take a picture of it while I'm running away, apparently. Chase me, bitch. It's down there, huh? There we go. Oh, it's directly below me. Holy shit. I, I, oh, shut up. I got it already. Did you get that conclusion? Snake in the basket! I saw you last second. I saw you. There really no other way to the other side of that map. Oh, I can't. I can't. No. Oh, all right. Well, that works, I guess. But I, I couldn't jump on that for some reason. All through the jungle level was all the. Wait, what? The... Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> He's on the boat. Greetings. You're Salim Al Kapar. Aren't you? And who are you? Uh, well, that part's kind of complicated. I'm a thief like you, but I'm kind of new in town. How about you come back to my gang's hideout and I can explain myself? How about you go lick a camel's hump? <laughs> okay. Look, I know you're in trouble. I'm here to help. I can explain everything, but let's go where we can talk safely. Besides, you look hungry. How would you like some food? Food? <laughs> it was foolish of you not to mention that in the first place. Let's go. Back at the hideout, introductions went quickly as Salim stuffed his face. He told us about his problem. Some new player calling herself Miss Decibel had rolled into town and started throwing lots of money around. It didn't take a genius to figure out who the time-traveling lieutenant was here. Salim and the three remaining thieves had decided to pull one last heist before disappearing into retirement, Miss Decibel being the target. Of course, with her technology, she had easily captured his thief brothers, and Salim had been trying to come up with a plan to free them ever since. Bentley uncovered some interesting background information. Miss Decibel had come from a wealthy British family. Her true love was classical music. Unfortunately, Bruh. You couldn't draw more than talent, two of the, like a different person. Made for a volatile combination. There's like two of the exact same person, like two seats away from each other. After suffering a freak accident during a tantrum, she was left unable to play music normally. However, when she discovered she could control people with her hypnotic tones, a new criminal was born. She began <laughs> using her devious talents to control others, forcing them to commit crimes for her. We told Salim about the paradox, and the whole thing made what? some strange kind of sense to him. The bad news was that he wasn't completely convinced that we were there to help him. I could see I was going to have to prove myself. Again. I, I, I just can't. 
She got a fucking trumpet shoved up her nose. And that's her superpower. <laughs> Mike, they only had to draw four unique people. The rest could have been background, and the rest weren't background, but come on, right there. Right there, Mike, come on. <laughs> Open says me. Oh, I, I ain't going over there. Hurry up and pass. You get this sneak sneak. Ooh. Oh god, my greatest enemy in the whole game. Water. Give me that. There we go. Okay, apparently Salim lost a small fortune betting on the camels a while back and had to pawn his thief outfit. <laughs> Sly, if we could buy that outfit back for Salim, I'm sure we could gain his trust. The shopkeeper is a security freak, a real head case. His place is a fortress and he never leaves. All business is conducted through a slot in the door. I think this is one time we're going to have to play it straight and pay the man what he wants. As you might imagine, his price is pretty steep. The shopkeeper will only accept payment in the form of flawless gemstones. Three to be exact. The only gems of that quality around here are the decorative stones embedded in the city walls. I've located the three largest specimens for you. All you have to do is remove them, avoid the guards, and bring them to the shop. Just make sure those gems are still flawless when you get there. Sure, I could steal more gems. Let's go get this one first. No Sorry, no discount. I didn't ask for one. Ah, there. What? What the? What? What? <laughs> what was that? Uh, I have many questions. I have too many questions. What the fuck was that? Was my main one? What the fuck? <laughs> I, I'm gonna go away now. I don't want to be near that anymore. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh. Oh, I'm oh, yeah, oh my god, do not get stuck on the environment again. Huh? Oh, it's on this one. Uh, my mistake. Uh, 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 oh my god, stop. I hate that. Ugh. I really hate that. Two gems down, one to go.
sure you get those gems to the shop in one piece. Good God. I am very glad because I am uncomfortable with those statues. <laughs> Bouncy, bouncy, bouncy. There we go. What do you want? I'm here to buy the thief outfit. Sorry, I do not believe one such as yourself could meet my price. Good day. Oh, that's too bad. Uh, I guess I'll just have to go bet these gems on the camel races. Wait, you have gems? Let me see. Man, these rocks are so heavy, I can barely lift them. You want the gems? I want the outfit. Do we have a deal? Indeed. If you want to purchase these old rags, who am I to object? All sales final, no returns. <laughs> Ooh, new costume, and the top of the screen is shaking violently for some reason. Uh, why are you doing that? Oh, it stopped. Ooh. Ha! Wee! Good job, Sly. Although it seems we have another problem. Feline tells me that Miss Decibel is constantly changing the locations of the captured thieves, which makes them almost impossible to track. It's gonna be... Hold on, Sly. I'm picking something up. I love Sly's outfit. It's so <laughs> snazzy. <laughs> Ah. Sounds like the perfect opportunity for a little eavesdropping. Great idea. Just one thing. That outfit won't fool these guards. They know the locals and they'll peg you for a stranger immediately. You should just stay out of sight. Thanks for the info, Bentley. I'm on my way. Ooh. No, no, no. I can't take this right now. Sword. Way to go, Sly. Now you better get going. Sly, don't let anyone see you. If the guards see you, it's over, Sly. I'm feeling a bit peckish. Must be time for a snack. You look just like a beautiful painting today. Picasso, perhaps. <laughs> I was hoping you would say that. <laughs> Your face looks messed up. <laughs> so, please tell me the operation is going according to plan. Of course, everything is progressing splendidly. I have those raggedy little thieves completely under my control. I've never seen better forgeries. The documents they are producing are of the highest quality. Perfect. Once I get them back to the present day, and my royal lineage is discovered, my wealth and power will be unstoppable. Well, <laughs> there is one tinsy little problem. <laughs> we still need to feed our little worker bees, but our supplies are running low. The one who calls himself the Pampa seems to work best when I feed him scorpion claws. Disgusting! <laughs> yeah, very well. I shall have some delivered immediately. Whatever it takes to keep these vermin working. Oh, and one more thing. 
tell your guys if they don't capture Cooper, I will have them all fired and then executed. That's a good motivator. Uh, do you hear that? They're creating a false royal identity for Le Paradox in the present day. If that happens, he'll be close to untouchable. They also need a delivery. The Panther needs scorpion claws. Maybe we can make that work Let's for us. Remember to bring a handkerchief next time. This desert is just one giant litter box. I'm feeling a bit peckish. Must be time for a snack. Cherie, your outfit is so stylish today. It is like the most luxurious tent. Tent? <laughs> Perfect. And I just had my tail shampooed. Have I ever told you how exquisite your eyes are? They are like uh -huh. two perfect, shiny little stones. <laughs> Tell me, stones. <laughs> Well, darling, this is my environment plays absolute havoc with my sinuses. <laughs> my music practice has been atrocious lately. Would you like to hear that? Not really, but I want you to hear me. Do not fail me like those other idiots, shall we? I'd hate to see you stranded here permanently. Oh, I, uh, I'll make sure that doesn't happen. Good. Because the others have failed. Even Penelope. And she was the smart one. But now I have <laughs> to turn my back on her. You understand. Oh, yes, of course. Everything will go precisely as planned. Uh, although, I must trouble you for some camel cheese. Absolutely horrid stuff, but the thief called the tiger seems to rely on it, and our reserves are almost depleted. Can't we just starve these filthy hoodlums into submission? Ah, fine. I will send a delivery boy. For a delivery? Why are you thinking what I'm thinking? Camel cheese? Yeah. Warn me before you do that. No! Fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. Fuck you! So, any more requests? Oh no, sweetums, I believe that's all. As soon as the documents are complete, I will deliver them personally. Magnifique! Then I should have them very soon. Oh wait, there is one lost itty bitty little thing. <laughs> the one called the lion seems to favor cobra tails. And you know how troublesome those are to obtain. Fine, you shall have them. But I had better get those papers quickly. Boy, I'd hate to be the guy that has to collect the cobra tail. Oh, yeah. Just to ensure it's foolproof, I'm gonna use my. No, Sly, don't say it! Italian accent! No. <laughs> no, not the Italian accent! God damn it, it's back! Welcome back, Fortune! Just in time. And who is this little pig squeak? Yes, identify yourself immediately. It's a me, uh, the delivery boy. You are called? Uh... Hmm, I don't recognize your scruffy features. The other boys are out the sick. Uh... Something about the snake bites. Is there something wrong with your voice? No, uh, I've been talking like this my whole life. How droll. He just I had the stroke. Uh, it's unfortunate. Yeah, really delivery person, then you would know the usual orders, no? 
What a food does the panther require? Oh, the panther loves the scorpion claws. He appears to be legitimate. Wow, one question, huh? Here are the delivery locations. Hurry up, please. Why is it a good thing we're in Arabia? Because in Italy, that accent would be considered a felony. I mean, I would have been fine answering that, Fortune. I, I knew the answers, but it was just like... Good God. Why are you Italian in Arabia? What? <laughs> Why did you pick that accent? You just had to make a call back to your shitty accent. <laughs> Look at that, I'm like selecting... I'm selecting Salim and he's like, oh uh, no, pick the other guy, I don't know, you should, you should pick that guy. I shouldn't have to go out there. is back and she's on mobile for a change. Over there, okay. I wonder what his special triangle attack is. Ow! You bit- you interrupted me! You stupid little scorpion... Crab, whatever the fuck you are. No! God, alright, what is it? Oh, what? What? Uh-oh, uh-oh. Ow? Tornado! Flawless. What? I got. I got. What? Did you see that? There was a flying carpet. What? Bye. All right, they're gone. We got distracted by a Laura Bailey video. Ooh, oh no, oh no, oh no. What? 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 I thought I fucked it up. I just poofed him out of existence. What the hell just happened? Oh, here we go. No! Stop! Flying carpet scam where he would pretend to be kind of pressed for time here. Fine, please continue. So, according to my diagrams, the shop is connected to the tower. There's a vent system on the side of the building. All you have to do is crawl through the vents and it will lead you straight into the shop. From there, you can make your way through the shop's interior to the tower. <laughs> you make it sound so easy. I would like to see you crawl through vents when you are my age. Talk to you inside the shop. Good luck! When you are my age? How old is he right now? I mean, he's got a gray mustache, but still. Oh god, I do- oh, I do not like the- I do not like that jiggle! Oh. Don't worry about it. Ow. Oh yeah, well. Go take a dip. No, the coins! The coins went in the water, son of a bitch.
No, what? What? Oh, no. Huh? There's this thing telling me to go. What? Oh, oh, right here. No, no, right there, dumbass. Could not see that. I thought it wanted me to scale the tower. I wonder if this Bentley will have me jumping through hoops next. First, mm -hmm. I grab the rope. Then I press the R2 button to climb up or down like lightning. Hmm? Huh? Climbing Cobra? What? Ah. Ow, goddammit. What? <laughs> it didn't do the thing. I'm confusion. Whoa! Oh, God. I had to hoop. I had to do up. I didn't do the up. Hazel, hi! Wait, this How was work today? My blueprint? You must have been renovated recently. Give me a minute to figure this out. Oh, by Aladdin's beard. Do you not know that rule number 37 in the Thieves' Handbook is expect the unexpected, foresee the unforeseen, predict the unpredictable? Keep your turban on. My sonar reading show an old passageway through a cave system beneath the floor. Let's see. Massive payload, angle of incident, relative humidity divided by two. Got it. Delete. If we could drop that pallet of carpet to the corner, it should slash a hole in the floor straight through to the caverns below. We? It seems that I will be doing all the work. How about we just talk when you reach the passageway? <laughs> I must steal whatever you got. Give me, give me, give me. No! Don't give me away! God damn it! It's all this stupid snake's fault. Don't, you stupid little snake bitch. Ah! Flawless. I don't think I can grab that from here, can I? Oh, unless it's a down one. Okay. Yeah, I wanted, wanted to get rid of the snakes. I didn't realize it would also alert the guards. I, the magic lamp. I would wish for this job to be over. Wow, those are some giant Diablo scorpions. Nasty. And probably this way. Sneaky, sneaky. Oh no, I just stuck my hand in. What did I stick my hand in? Ugh. Shall I bring you back some scorpions, Bentley? <coughs> just like chicken. No thanks. I'm trying to cut back. Oh, those are piles of bones. Gimme. Gimme, 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 gimme all shit. It's like three coins in there. Woo! All right, believe you're in. Now you just have to make your way to the top of the tower. Of course, climbing, my favorite. I 
don't see an access point, but that lever looks worth investigating. Hmm. And be careful not to stir up the scorpion nests in here. What? Go smack the scorpion nest? Is that what you said? <sighs> what if I just break Go away, snake! Snake! God damn you! Oh my god, there's so many of them! What? Why did you- Was there another fucking- There was. There we go. Now that should be all of them. There we go. <laughs> so many Metal Gear Solid references. Ow. Up. Oh, I'm so faced. Am I supposed to go over? Oh, there it is. I would much rather be riding a camel with three humps. Peel you like a banana. Oh, didn't realize he was actually looking. I'm gonna peel you like a banana. You know. I would much rather be riding a camel with three humps. There we go. Thousand thank you once again for this most excellent idea. What? Oh. Woo! What? <laughs> oh, Cobra's in first! No! Uh, first stop it! it. Excuse me. Shut up! Alright. Mm -hmm. All these blades and traps. Just what an old thief wants to see. <laughs> Whoop! Nope, I wasn't supposed to land on top of them? Well, then where was I supposed to go? Probably somewhere else entirely. Yep. Different ledge. Oh, at least this lucky fellow is getting some rest. There we go. Pull that out a little more. Oh god. Okay. There we go. We're fine. I right. oh, what? So weird how it doesn't want to like latch sometimes. Whoop oh, up. Oh, bad timing. What? Oh, uh, my day was good, Hazel. Didn't really do much. I was enjoying my day off. Ooh, Hazel's making dinner. What you making? Ow! What? 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 <laughs> what? What? There we go. Stop it! You and you. You know what? I hit that snake in the throat. It's worth it. It was worth it, you hear me? You fucking slithery bitch. 
Yes, I know I can stall the snake's uh, fortune. I just wish I could kill them. Because I hate them. Stop! No. I don't like the snakes, Shy. They're mean to me. He's just chilling. Look at him. He's hang on. Let me zoom in. He's just chilling. <laughs> My controlled by music streamers got some explaining to you. I didn't do anything. But look at that guy. He's just he's fucking whacked out. <laughs> Heck time. Oh god, motion controls. Oh, it's over there. Come on, on god damn it. There was two of them I could have gone to the right. <laughs> Am I Ms. Desbel? I mean, you haven't seen me use a webcam. I can't say I'm not Ms. Desbel. Alright, where the fuck am I going? Over there. I see, I see, I see, I see. Ah! God damn it. There we go. Oh, I hit left. You didn't go? Maybe I just needed to hit it faster? Reap! Oh my god. There we go. Wow, a whole two seconds more. I I don't know what I'll do with all that time. Ah, don't do that. Stop. Lord. My brother, are you all right? Oh, oh, my head. Where am I? You have been imprisoned, hypnotized, and compelled to create forgeries by that evil elephant. But I have freed you from her mesmerizing music with, you know, some assistance. That's nice. I'm hungry. Did you bring me anything to eat? Perhaps some nice roasted scorpion tails? Maybe some camel milk? Amazing. I climb halfway to the stars to rescue you. And you expect camel milk? Why do I bother? 
We got him, though. Beautiful. Oh, Lauren, thank you so much for the resub. How are you doing? I like, uh, it's, it's literally December 1st, and there's Santa hats on everything. Yeah, the little victory jingles are so cute. You're doing good? That's good to hear. Since before Thanksgiving? Are you serious, Mike? Oh my god. Why? Yeet. Yeet. Why this is going to get dicey. Security has definitely been beefed up. Those turrets are too well protected to attack directly. Ordinarily, I'd hack the security system, but that might take some time, and we need to hurry. There's no telling when Decibel might move the lion again. This may be our only chance. So, what are you thinking, Bentley? I think we need to use some smoking mirrors. Uh, minus the mirrors. Meaning? I'll use the RC chopper to drop smoke bombs at strategic points, which should keep the turrets from seeing you. Then, since Salim knows this city like the back of his hand, he can guide you to a secure location. Hopefully he's had his nap today. <sighs> Just make sure you get to a safe spot before the smoke clears, otherwise you're gonna be missile bait! Alright, so am I playing the chopper, or am I playing them? I could drop smoke bombs with the R1 button, and boost my speed with the L1 button! No. Uh -oh. I don't know where I'm supposed to drop this. All right, Bentley. Bombs away. There goes my paint job. Oh my god. Oh yeah, right on the button. I gotta shake these things. Oh my god, that's probably not close enough. Hello, oh, it is. Hello. <coughs> Wait, where's the other one? Over here. Oh, no, thank you. Oh, I fucked and missed that one real bad. Well, that was a good shot. Oh, the loafer. Good job, Bentley. Okay, Fly, it's all you. Okay, Celine, we're on. Follow me closely and don't fall behind. Don't worry about me. I'll be right on your tail. Yeah, I, I love the Christmas like aesthetics as well. Just like the pretty lights and the shiny colors, but like chill. Give me some cover, pal. Talk about a smoke break. Your views are really forgiving, aren't they? Oh, yeah, oh, that's really bad. That was not right on the money. Don't lie to me. Oh! All right, there we go. Age before beauty. No, 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 you mean wisdom before you. Would you two get going? Just waiting on the wise guy, Bentley. Hmm. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that guy was really high up there. Time for the smoke, buddy. Oh, that was a spicy shot. 
That's a good one. Look out below. Stay Damn it. Target, Drop that. Oh, what? Oh my god, it, it, the bomb, it, it hit the bomb. Fuck. There we go. How do you like them smoke signals? Oh, I did that way too early. Fuck. Oh! There we go. That should be... Yeah. There we go. No. What? What is it hitting? Here, hit over there, maybe. That was closer than all the other ones? Really? Alright, whatever. There we go. <laughs> Open sesame. That outfit makes you a better thief, Sly, not a genie. Now, why don't you help me with this door? <laughs> oh, another zonked out person. Look at him. Whoa, sesame. <laughs> so you got lucky. Whew. The stench in here is making my eyes water. I feel sorry for your friend. That decibel is really cruel. Well, unfortunately, that might be the lion's socks. He always hated doing laundry. Oh, well, maybe she's he's... just protecting her sense of smell. He's not wearing socks. What? Okay, Sly, get to that device so I can free this guy. He's not wearing socks. Press X to doubt. Okay, Sly, stand back and let me work my hacking magic. It's time for more hacking. Please, more, please, some more more sync controls. Oh, shooting one, yes. I got no POW level. Gimme give those. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme, Give me that. Oh, and yeah. give me that. Give me. Every little ionic bit helps. Oops, excuse me. I need that big one right there. That big juicy one. Boom. I have missiles now. Give me that. Woo!
Oh, well, how did I get over there? Teleported. Stop it, whore. God, go away. Oh, this is gonna take forever now. I, I, I'm behind cover! Explain yourself right now. You better get ready for some real mega. Did you see that? I was getting shot behind cover. I'm just bad at hacking, apparently. Oh, shit. Dang, should I be right? I'm bad at hacking. Oh, give me that. I'm gonna hide over here. I don't fucking trust you no more. Give me that. Whoop. Nope. Why are you going up? Why are you moving when I don't move it? There we go. Dang, Shy called me out for not knowing computer shit. Savage. Nightmare, my friend. Salim, you are in my dream too. You brought me many delicious snacks. What is with you guys and all the food? Salim, who is this insolent pup? Oh, don't worry about him. He is a friend who helped rescue you. In fact, he is my assistant. Assistant? What are you talking about? Why? Play along. <laughs> it's better if less people know what's going on anyway. Great. It's gonna be a long day. Oh, and don't forget what's left of that device fly. I'm almost done with a little invention of my own. I've been good, Devine. Everything's been good. Have a good night when I'm gaming. <laughs> <laughs>